the most talked about show in Hollywood. Three words. Television show. Watch our time. Pantomime quiz time. <laughs> Yes, friends, it's Mike Stokey's pantomime quiz time with regulars Adele Jerkins, Hans Conrad, Vincent Price, and Jackie Coogan and a panel of four of your favorite guest stars on the oldest and most honored show in the movie cabinet. And here to start off tonight's festivities is your host, Mike Stokey. Thank you, Ed Rogers. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the pantomime quiz. We've got our regulars, we've got our guests. I want you to meet them, then we'll get right underway with our show. You know our regulars, of course, but I want to introduce them to you personally again. Here we go. First... Scheduled to be born any moment, Adele Jurgen. <laughs> Upstage, in his favorite position, is Mr. Hans Hungry. <laughs> then next to Hans, while they're insulting each other, you'll forgive me, Vincent Price. Uh, how do you do? Oh, how do you do? <laughs> next to Vince, the kid himself, Jackie Coogan. Good evening, folks. <laughs> now I want to introduce our guests, whom I think will give them a terrific battle. Let's take a look at them close up right now. I'll say this, we've never had two lovelier gals on our guest team at the same time. I think you'll agree. Here's the first one, Miss Jean Wallace. Good evening. And then over here to Jean's left, your right. Oh, this guy, believe me, this is great having him back because he was one of the original regulars. I know you'll recognize him after a while, but I'll mention his name anyway. This is Frank DeVore. Oh, no. <laughs> Next to Frank, we're very happy to have her back. It's been some time, Miss Dorothy Patton. Hello. And then downstage there, none other than an old favorite of yours and ours, Greg McClure. <laughs> now, just one more. Love to start off with a gal like this, Jean Wallace. Will you on, step Jean. up, please? Jean. Poor Jean, it's her first time on the show. She hasn't played the game. She's dying a million deaths. Look, I know about the good man? humor, man. <laughs> <laughs> Tell us, though, about uh, Buenos Aires and the native son. Huh? Well, all I know is I loved Buenos Aires. Are the native sons down there any better than up here? Mm. No, fella. <laughs> 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 all right, Jeannie, I tell you, uh, you're going to draw a number out of here, and I'll explain it as we go along. Go okay. ahead, draw any number. Number 11, now what we do, we show only you folks at home and in the studio audience here, the people upstage, on stage, they have no idea what it is until I hand them a card. Okay, that was sent in incidentally by Mrs. Bessie Fuller from Philadelphia, so let's show you people out there. Let me remind you from off stage that Gene Wallace has drawn the proverb, the hand that rocks the cradle rules the world. Gene. All right, Jeannie, they know at home. Here we go. You only got a couple seconds to look at it. That's all right. Wait for the buzzer. Go ahead. You're off. Who's the strange uh, looking guy? Uh, That's the wrong proverb. Nine words. Nine, Nine words. Um, First, First word. word. A and B. Um, we got that. Uh, he's talking second, second word. Uh, hand. 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 The, the hand, hand that. Uh, not you. Not that you. is the third word. That the hand the, that feeds up. The hand, hand that. <laughs> the hand that. Fourth, fourth word. Uh, that rocks the cradle. The, the hand that, that, that rocks the, the cradle. cradle. Is, is that right it's, so uh, far? It's what? Is the, the one that the cooks the meals? The no. hand that rocks uh, the cradle is is a is, seventh is, word. Is, seventh word is the uh -uh. is talking. Uh, is what? Mother? <laughs> judge? Is soldier? That rules the world. The, is that rules, it? Rules the world? Is that it? The hand that rocks the, the cradle rules, rules the world. Oh, that's it. Let's just put it together. Wonderful. That wasn't so tough. Your first time? No. The hand that rocks the cradle rules the world. That's the first. That's oh, it's, very it's, good. Uh, as a matter of fact, it did say, how do you know? The Gene Wallace, you got your team off to a very good start with only 50 seconds. Mike, I have a priceless bit, the price is wit. Vincent Price. Oh. Yeah, but Vince, uh, hey, kid, get a load of this. This man has just been voted one of the best dressed men in the country. And How? He's Vincent not even the price of all people. He's not even the best padded man in the country. <laughs> That's <laughs> jealous. No, really, you, uh, look, you, you look very good. You uh, like that as who, well as what who, they're wearing no, this year? No, that's Who, who, who was responsible for that? His uh, tailor. For this new uh, statement. <laughs> of that. No, I mean, uh, uh, well, uh, well, it was the uh, Men's Apparel Guild in California. Uh, uh, were, were they serious? They would, no, yes. Western California. costume did this. <laughs> <laughs> like something I'll say this. Oh, you're so jealous. I'll say this. Vince will dress comfortably. Now, look at him. When he wants to dress up, he's the greatest, but most of the time he will just dress comfortably. <laughs> and, and his idea of comfort. Oh, I know. Are you kidding? You can't wear any whole cut thing like that. Uh, the bartered bride. Please, go ahead. Number uh, six for Vincent Price. Vincent was sent in by Lester Platt. 
From Los Angeles, California, let's take a look at the card. It's a Shakespearean stumper for Vincent Price. Oh, what a noble mind is here o'erthrown. The couriers, soldiers, scholars, eye, tongue, sword. Okay, they know at home, Vince. Let me find your card. Here it is. You got a Oh, this oh, is rough. I, I'm warning you. Come on, Vince. Let's go. Yes. <sighs> All business. A gag. The gag saying? No, it lies. Shakespeare. Shakespeare. Oh, Shakespeare. Shakespeare. First word. Which play? Oh. Uh, song. Song? Um, no. Oh. Shakespeare. 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 Right, we know that. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. And we know it's key word. Uh, Five word. words. Clown. Head. Head. Clown. Think. Thinking. Thought. Brain. Thinking. Brains. Uh, mind. Meditation. What? Mind. 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 Mm -hmm. mind of a. And that's the fifth word is mind. Hurt. Hurt. Eight. 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 Yeah. Eight. Overthrow. Overthrow. Throw up. Throw up. Oh, what a noble mind is here on throne. Now what? Oh, the noble mind is here on throne. And, uh, Then, then again. And, and it, it is of a two. It of soldier scholar, soldier scholar, courtier, courtier, courtier. Then what? Is it soldier the next? Courtier. Tenth word is courtier. Courtier. Um, second word. Twelve. Soldier, scholar. I tell them so. Oh, no. Oh, no. I just hear our throne. Can't hear soul, your skull. I tell them so. I tell them so. No, no. <laughs> I'm sorry. So, I am Tom. Tom, I am so. Yeah. So are Tom and I. No. Well, come on. It's easily done. We know it. Now, help. I haven't read anything since the motor no, voice. Oh, what a noble mind is here our throne. Mm -hmm. Caught here, soul, your skull. Yes, I, I, I tongue and sword. I tongue sword. <laughs> no, 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 that is so good. Cool. Yeah, that is so good. Cool. I, I, I tell you, here's the only difference. The courtiers, soldiers, Oh, the scholars, courtiers, soldiers, scholars, I, I tongue, tongue and sword. sword. You just didn't have the answer. And, 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 You guys don't want This is too tough no, re really, if you had gone like this... If you don't know your and this, you would have taken it first. Vince took you a minute and 40 seconds for that Shakespearean gem, which puts the guess ahead a nice, pretty round 50 seconds. From a hamlet and a ham to a lovely dish, up you come, Dorothy Patton. Oh, okay. <laughs> you have the of all sorts of eyes. Dorothy, you've done one million pictures since you've been on, but let's talk about 7-Eleven Ocean Drive. Well, mm -hmm. I had the opportunity to work with a very fine director in that, George really? Newman. Oh, yeah. Oh, and speaking of directors, I recently did a radio program directed by a very good director, your very own Hans oh, Conrad. No. Boom! Oh, oh, what a, what a, uh, a poor parley from oh, Newman yeah. to Conrad. Yeah. No, I'm, I'm only kidding. Know, All right, Dorothy, let's see what you can do here with Hans. Uh, try. Incidentally, you can't talk to her. Number seven for Dorothy Patton. Patrick, by the way, I almost forgot last time on the timing. That was our little gal, Sandra Spence, who opens the show each time. She's wonderful. She'll be showing you the time every time. Okay. That was sent in by Hester. <laughs> what a name. Hester Lee from Rochester, New York. You. Let's hey, take a look at it. Here's a bit of an old song title for Dorothy Patrick. Painting the Clouds with Sunshine. <laughs> All right, Dorothy. Hester and the kids know it, so here you are. Take your time, Dottie. we got a big yeah. lead. You're out. Yeah. You're in. About ten seconds. Okay. Uh, song. song. Popular song, five, five, five words. words. First, First word. Paint. Paint. Painter. Painting. 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 Painting the clouds with sunshine. Oh! 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 Dorothy, you're lucky to have a musical conductor on your show, namely Frank Duvall. It only took you 12 seconds. Going on one two punch on the regulars, Hans Conried. Hans, would you like to uh, talk about uh, your antiques or your art collection? Oh, no, please. <laughs> you're very kind. No. Uh, I'd like to say up to the Don't upstage Stokey. Oh, on. this man, I, I tell you, he will not. Oh, this is instinctive. I don't think about it. I have well, two syllables. Can you get away from the man on the outside? Thank you, thank you. Go ahead. Go. No, Number uh, four for Hans Conrad. Hans, that was sent in by Helen Tasker from Hollywood, California. Helen and all you people out there, let's look at it. Now, a Japanese proverb for Hans Conrad. The quickest way to lose face is by shooting it off. All right, Hans, they know at home. Here it is. You've got a couple seconds to look at it. What is it? Uh, okay. 
By shooting, by shooting you, me, and no, face, face, hand, hand no. Present, place, that, now. shooting now, that, there, this, that, that, him, that, that, this, that, 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 no, 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 them, that, there, that, these, 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 shooting uh, uh, thy, this, this, it, this, this, it. Oh, it. by shooting it, by shooting it off. No, no, they got a word in there. Keep going. No, 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 this is an old Japanese old saying you just Japanese returned from Japan, so you should know it. Uh -huh. It's very old, anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Hans, you didn't lose face because it only took you a minute and 20 seconds. And according to Sandra, that puts the guess ahead. Oh, here we go again. A minute and 58 seconds. Time now to call the great John L. Up you go, Greg McClure. You can't hear the guy. Here's a guy with five unreleased pictures, <laughs> one of which I know is breakthrough. You want to tell us about it? Who's, who's in it, Greg? Well, uh, David Bryan, Frank uh -huh. Lovejoy, John Agar. It's, uh, you know, we ought to have this guy along with George O'Brien with his coat off. This, this is a muscle <laughs> man. Incidentally, you're, you're very good on rub-downs, masseurs, and stuff like that, huh? Take, Sit down. Take right, after right after the show. kidding? <laughs> right after the show. I love him. All right. right. Give no, him. I mean, give him. Oh, you, oh, you know. know. Oh, you, uh, uh, number one me. for Greg McClure here. Greg, that was sent in by... Uh, what am I saying? This is one where you guys are going to have to work out there. No voice off stage, no slide, no nothing. But I do want to tell you something so you can stump stars like Greg and Gene Wallace and Dorothy Patrick. Frank Duvall, oh, yeah. Why, yeah. right in stumpers yeah. to me, yeah. Mike Stokey yeah. and Kara. Yeah. Pantomime quiz time, Hollywood, California. Send as many as you want. And if you do stump the stars, you win not one, two, five, or seven, but this entire set of these beautiful Evans lighters. Oh, oh no, oh, my yes. This entire set of these beautiful Evans lighters. All right, here's your card, Greg. Uh... <laughs> Peter, Peter the Wolf. Yeah, it looks like a Peter Wolf from Maywood, California, sent it in. Frank should guess this. Okay. You're in. The, the, you okay. people get this, too. We get this one now, huh? Oh, oh, proper. Proper. Uh, six, six words. words. First word. No, no. Second, second. word. Yeah. Starts with the second you. word. Me, you, he, me, he, His. me, mine, him, I'm. Second, second word. word. You, Man. your, your, your. your. Third word. Third word. Uh, how do you do this? <laughs> <laughs> pull. Um, what's wagon. Your pull it, wag. Wagon. Your, your, your wagon. Your red wagon. No, your wagon. Hitch your wagon to a star. That's it. That's it. Oh, this Duvall boy is really successful. I'm doing all these. Yeah, stuff. Know, Frank Duvall, is it? Yeah. I, that was good, Frank Greg. Uh, did you guys at home get it? That's a problem. That's a problem. It's a. No, it should be a saying. Anyway, you guys, what are you beeping about? 38 yeah. seconds for you to pull that little old thing. 38 very seconds. Good. Hey, Mike, he's very good. Very good. You're there, too. Yeah. Yeah. How'd you get wagon? <laughs> Greg McClure took you 38 mad seconds. Come on. Oh. All right, from the McClure to the demure. Oh! oh. Yeah. Oh. Adele, tell us. You know, we've been talking about this picture for months. It's got to come out. Never. Sugarfoot. Uh, Sugarfoot. Sugarfoot. Oh, Sugarfoot. <laughs> Listen, she's she, she, backing she, up on him. Uh, you saw what she did. She pulled a con read on him. Mm -hmm. You are upstairs. Much too young. It is going to be. And by the way,